Hello and welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to my 25-man headway guide for the Pinch King. There must always be a Pinch King. Have you ever killed those random elite Makruras got around Pandaria? They drop like a seashell kind of thing and it tells you to combine it with five other seashell things in order to get something. And that's what we're gonna focus on. We need to collect all six of these seashells in order to create the item which summons the Pinch King so you can obtain the... Oh god, here it comes. You better sit down. Lobstmord. Yes. And the first time you kill one of those Makrura, here's the position on the map by the way, you will get a book called Troubles from Without. And it gives you some short backstory about this and some clues as to where to find them. So the first one is called Akalo and it says this female has been known to attack the fishermen of Srila village in times of hunger. Reports vary whether she is simply a nuisance or an outright menace. Last seen on the rock southwest of Windward Isle in the Jade Forest. Next one is called Akalar, he's also in the Jade Forest, here's the position, and the book says Akalar is renowned among his kind for his thick carapace. His brazen tax on the Jinnu of the Jade Forest suggests either arrogance or strength, potentially both. Last seen on the southern tip of the Jade Forest south of Penelfin village. third fellow on our list is called Damlak. Once again, here is the location, and the book says Omnia scholars have suggested that the Makrura have some capacity in magic. Those who have seen Damlak know this to be true. This shadowy creature wanders the islands and seafloor between the Cradle of Chiji and Nayeli Lagoon in the Karasang Wilds. Next we have Clamstock. Once again here is the location and the book says An absolute brute from beyond the wall, known for his overwhelming strength. Even the Mantid keep a fair distance from this one, last seen of the northwestern coast of Zanves. Second to last fellow is called Odnirok, and the book says, Odnirok does not fight with his claws as the other Makura do, instead he possesses a crude shamanic power fighting with the forces of water itself. He was last seen on the shore south of the cliffs of Silves in Taulong Steppes. I would also like to point out that I found a giant flying turtle ghost. Yeah, that's a thing. And the last Makrura gentleman on our list is called Kisha once again, here is the location, and the book says, a furious warrior from the icy waters of the north, last seen patrolling the rocky coast of Kunlai Summit, west of Zuchin village. So once you have obtained all six of the Makrura shells, you will go right here, where you can combine the amulet or shell thing, and you can summon the Pinch King, called Crawl Lord Krillmandar. And the book says, while we are discussing Makarura, I must mention Krillmandar, known as the Claw Lord, or the Terror of the Southern Tide. Krilmandar has not been seen in years. Our lookouts along the south wall have inspected his island far to the west of the cradle of Chiji and have not seen any signs of his return. And here is the Pinch King. I would also like to point out that if you fail to defeat the Pinch King, he will despawn and the item will be lost, so you have to kill the Makrura again. So be careful or bring a buddy. And once you defeat the Pinch King, you get the Lobstmorn. Oh yes. <laughs> silly, silly item, but it's cool that it's there. And I thank you a lot for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.